Welcome to the Real Andy of Beverly Hills Show. Hello, Beverly Troop. Welcome back. I'm the Real Andy of Beverly Hills, and welcome to another piece of tea of the day. Girl, it is Thursday, and the weekend is almost here, and I have to tell you, I know that after everything that has been going on this week, we need a weekend to relax. We need to, like, you know, like, go to another world, go out, party, or go and watch a movie, or just do something to kind of, like, distract yourself of all of the BS that is happening right now around the world and this country and, like, everything, you know? So... I'm kind of like excited for this weekend because it was a lot. It was a lot, definitely. But anyways, girl, where are my fans of Southern Charm? Because we need to talk this like fake, weird relationship that is going around between JT and Venita. Girl, girl. And what is really happening over here? So anyways, before we start, welcome back. If you are new here, welcome to the Broadly Troop where I keep it real and I mention it all. So if you want to know what is happening inside of the Bravoverse with the pop culture streets and more, well, you know what to do. Subscribe, 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 and hit that notification bell. And girl, it is time to give a shout out to the partners of this video and are the people from this loyalty. This loyalty is a membership subscription that will give you amazing discounts in hotels and restaurants all around the world. So if you want to, you know, check it out, like, girl, I have been work, I have, I have used them for a very long time. If you follow me on my other YouTube channel, Destination and This World, you know that I love to travel around the world, you know, and have fun and find deals and all of that. So I have used them before, but now we are officially partnering up. And that is very exciting. So if you want to check it out, go to the link in the description below. And don't forget to use my code M-A-M-A-L-A-09 and you will get the first month for free. Okay, so you can actually check it out. All right, guys. So let's talk about this whole situation when the, the trailer of Southern Charm dropped, you know. Uh, everyone is kind of like talking about their favorites, what is going on. And we have this new character, JT, who joined last season, you know. And it kind of has been like a... A breakout star, meaning that he has the quality to move forward into the Southern Charm universe, you know. Um, but there has always been like something little weird about him, right? And then we come this season just to find out. Like last season, his whole storyline was like, ah, I'm in love with um, what is her name? <sighs> Shit, I'm blanking out. Uh, Shep uh, Taylor, Taylor, yeah. I'm in love with Taylor, you know, and like, oh my God, I love you so much. I will defend you. I will protect you. That shit didn't went anywhere, you know? So now this season, he's coming forward being basically like, oh my God, Venita, I love you. You are the girl for me. And people are being like, girl, what is going on? It doesn't seem sincere whatsoever, okay? And now everyone is kind of like wondering, is this guy really that thirsty for the show that he will just get on a relationship with anyone just to be part of the storyline? Because last season, it didn't end up well for him. I mean, basically, a lot of people were like, why is this guy here? You know what I mean? And now she also is trying to like have like a love triangle. And, like The whole thing is a mess. So I'm going to read you this little part of the article over here. It says, after she sharing a series of photos of himself with a woman named Ali Pereles, who recently opened up about JT, who recently opened up about his diabetes healthy journey, was met with backlash from fans as he called out for potentially staging a fake love triangle with Venita. Uh, long overdue, JT wrote in the caption of a November 3 live show on Instagram. He also included a hashtag for it's complicated. Someone says, what the F is wrong with you? A person named Kendall Perilous, who is rumored to be Ali's sister, asked. But what about Venita? Wonder another. Uh, 
God, I hope you and Venita are engaged with a baby on the way. Another person says, okay, this one made me smile. As Best of Bravo shared the odd comment on their Instagram, they also noted that Venita had unfollowed JT and says, imagine being in a fake love triangle with Jared, JT, Thomas, and Venita Aspen. A comment by Ali read in the screenshot shared by the real moms of Bravo on Instagram. Then, when another person encouraged Ali to spill the tea, she wrote, the truth will come out. Your boy isn't as kind and honest as he proclaimed. Girl, I have to tell you, this is what I don't like. If you're going to go into a reality show and you don't have an interesting life to show or a personality big enough to be interesting on a reality show, then they're going to fall into this fake storylines, you know? And the thing is, it's, it's, it's going to be so obvious. He wants to be like Shep. She wa- he wants to be like Craig. He wants to be like Austin, you know? And, and kind of like have what they have. And he just can't have it. And he's now is going to start playing with all of these ladies. Now, I do believe that these ladies are possibly... No, possibly no. I'm very sure that they are way smarter than him. And I'm really going to hope that Venita is going to be looking through the bullshit, you know, because it's kind of like if you, if Venita end up getting messy with JT, it's kind of like feeding into the thirstiness, you know, it's kind of like, okay, so this is going to be our storyline. We're going to pretend to fall in love, you know, but it is just like, this is Bravo girl. We can see through the bullshit. And if we, if this is just what people are saying, literally only based on the trailer, imagine what we are going to be saying when it really comes to the show. Now, my thing with Southern Charm is that I feel that little by little, we are getting to the end of the road of the storylines, you know? And I believe that the show might be coming to an end soon if they don't do something to really portray. Now, the difference that Southern Charm has uh, with the other shows like Vanderpump Rules or, you know, I don't know, Shots of Sunset or something like that, you know, it's just like a group of people living in Charleston. So there is really no connection whatsoever. So we can be invested on new people. But they really, I feel that lately they have just been bringing like these thirsty people to the show who just want to be on a reality show, you know? And they, they're just like, I just do whatever. And they, it's not like a real storyline behind it. You know what I mean? So I think we definitely need, I mean, it could work, but it needs to be treated in the right way. You know what I mean? So anyways, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Do you believe that this weird like love triangle thing, it is a real thing or is it just going to be for show? What do you think? Let me know. And if you want to get all the tea related to Southern Charm or any of the other Bravo shows, Make sure to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I'll see you around. See ya. Bye.